Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I was just playing, waiting for somebody to email me. And I came up with this design I drew in just a few minutes. And it's pretty cool. I'm not saying you'd ever use this, but if you ever wanted to create your own squiggle, uh, this would be pretty cool. And how I did this, I took my spiral tool, and I had it on this one, and I put 12 spirals. And I just made a bunch of spirals. Then I control D and mirrored it. Then I control D and mirrored it the other direction. And then I control D and mirrored it back. That's all I did. Then I took my smart fill tool and filled in these Well, that didn't work. There we go. Nope. You know what I need to do is probably take it all. Let's make sure I get it all. Go up to range and combine it. Now let's try to fill it in. Here we go. This is all I did. I think there's one more up top. Then Select it all, make sure you get it all, and left or right click, no outline. We've still got something down here and you can see it, but it's like invisible. But anyway, we're not gonna worry about it right now. We're gonna, we're gonna group this together. And I'm gonna take let me zoom in here. This is exactly how I did the first one. Take the envelope tool, and I'm going to bring the envelope tool all the way to that point. Now I'm going to stretch it out a little bit, kind of make it elongated. Control D and make a duplicate and mirror it. I mean, look at that. In just a few seconds, really, you've made a pretty good squiggle. And you can do a lot with it. There's something still there. What you can do to get rid of that is set your nudge distance set pretty high. Let's set it on 10 inches. And let's nudge that out of the way and nudge that out of the way. And then it should. There's something right there. It's, it's the spiral. I didn't delete it. Anyway, then you can do a lot with this. You could fill it in. Make it black, make it a little bit different looking. You could do what I did in the other parts. Control D, make a duplicate of it and rotate it 45 degrees. Control D, rotate it again. And there you have a pretty cool star flake, a star snowflake. Can't talk. Well, let's see what happens when you take it apart. I mean, that it, in itself, would be a pretty good squiggle if you maybe put a line through there and there's a lot you could do with it let's mirror it again and i mean just there's a lot you could do with this let's mirror it back i mean just in itself and you know i came up with these just in the same time i made the video for and then i just took half of it and made that Anyway, so that's just playing with the spiral tool. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.